I dropped my phone, so Zadie retrieved it for me. This crosswalk is on a hill, so it's harder to cross. Obstacle 1. This giant hill. This hill is very steep. I must keep my hands on. My wheels the whole time. I did not take the bus because it is often inaccessible. At this time of day, I either have to leave very early to be on time, or be laid to class. This is assuming. The bus is on time and can take me. Too often, the bus is behind. The lift brakes. The driver doesn't know how to load a wheelchair user, or the driver refuses to board me. Second obstacle, here is a food robot. I cannot stop suddenly because the hill is so steep. So when the robot stops suddenly, I run into the robot.
Third obstacle, another robot. I did not run into it this time, thankfully, but to go around it, I had to go into the bike lane. If this was a normal, with sidewalk, I'd be stuck. Obstacle 3.5, ramp. This ramp is very steep. I've lost control here before. It's scary. I use the rail to help keep me steady. Zadie needed a poop break. I had to take off her diaper so she could go. I also made her hold her own poop bag, lol. This sidewalk was pretty clear today, sometimes. Cars park too far forwards, and the front end of their car blocks the sidewalk. It makes it so that we cannot pass comfortably, or sometimes we cannot pass at all. It stopped to throw away the poop bag. This area is bumpy on really bad pain days. It can hurt to wheel across. Obstacle 4. Another ramp. This ramp has no stops and has a lot of potholes, which can hurt and or can catch a wheel. If I let go of my wheels, I'll roll backwards. That is what makes this not a true stop. I was really tired by this point, so it took a while. We finally made it. Obstacle 5, broken door button. My service dog gets confused when the door does not open after she has pressed the button. These doors are really heavy, hard to open in a wheelchair. Plus I have to make sure my service dog does not get crushed as we enter. 
Luckily, another student helped me by holding the door as we went in. This elevator is really small, not much room to maneuver. If I had a bigger wheelchair, I'd be worried about not being able to turn around. If I ride with anyone else, I typically can't turn around. There isn't enough room. Usually, the chairs in this classroom are everywhere, and I have to clear a path. That was not the case today, which was nice. I have to use the desk attached to the chair, which is uncomfortable. After class, I went to go to work in the lab. It was on the third floor. Here is obstacle six. The elevator was broken and would be for another week and a half. I cannot go to work or go to. My class is on the second and third floor. We went home. I decided to try the bus, but the driver couldn't figure out how to maneuver the lift at my stop so I wheeled back up the giant hill. Thankfully, a student helped me a bit. Now to do it all again tomorrow.